Welcome, welcome, welcome. Whoa, gonna do my Taurus. Queen of Wands wants to pop out there. Gonna do my Taurus, rest of January. Just giving a, a quick little sneak peek. See what we're looking at. What's coming our way. That kind of stuff. Taurus, Taurus. Um, and then I'm just gonna give you your best advice, okay? Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Oh, you guys are about to get deep. You guys just went deep with my ass. Makes me feel like I'm All right, six of pence. Wow. Um, it's been a long time since you balance out the scales with something in your life. Whether it's a person, place, a thing, it's it's whoa. It's way overdue. It is definitely time to do some de-weeding. Okay. Two of Cups. Yeah, see what I said? Damn. Damn. It's been a long time since these scales have been balanced with this particular individual. Okay, which is the Seven of Swords. So there was... Bear with the construction, guys. I'm sorry. Okay. They're ripping the porch down. So it's, it's pretty rowdy. Let's see what's at the bottom of the deck. All right, it's the Ace of Pens. It's, it's a brand new start. It's getting yourself out of these weeds. Well, whatever this is has not been balanced out or come into fruition. With the Seven of Swords here, this is somebody coming back to talk about what happened. You know, this is karma coming back around. It's getting to the bottom of things, why things were sabotaged, why things didn't work out. You know, it's it's a beautiful connection you have with somebody, but the, the scales are not balanced yet. Okay, so, um, hold on a minute. Yeah, this is, this is all, this is your purpose. This is getting going. This is, this is trying to mend this. This is, this situation is way deeper than you think it is. And there's definitely a purpose here. Okay. Um, you could be feeling drawn to something right now. Um, don't try to perfect anything. This is a, a spiritual journey. This is really going within it and trying to figure out what you're going to do because you might even sacrifice, you might even, you're going to have to sacrifice something apparently, but you might, you might be the one to even sabotage something if you don't give this connection an even give and take, if you don't give it the chance that it deserves maybe, you know, um, the ace of pens, it's, it's a new stat. I keep seeing this dang grasshopper in this pad. I wonder what a grasshopper means spiritually. I guess I'm about to find out for your ass. Spiritual meaning of a grasshopper? Different meanings throughout the entire world that doesn't even give me anything in particular. Grasshoppers are one of the most powerful spirit animals. If a grasshopper appears in your life, it's for you. If you dream about one, it, you sh definitely you definitely should not ignore it. Different meanings. Could you unlock your car so I could get my key out of it? Yeah. Um, different meanings here. You guys are gonna have to you guys are gonna have to look that up because I'm just gonna here you go. All right. I'm gonna just give it to you. Um, you guys are gonna have to look that up. It's, it's a big, it's a big one. I guess in China they even keep them for pets. Okay, so I don't know. It's just the first thing I, I see. Okay, so I want you to Google that yourself. Okay, but yeah, best advice for my Taurus, my little Tibetans. This is a connection that needs to be meshed together, balanced out. There's a chance that someone might sabotage this situation, but this looks like somebody's coming back. From the dead, somebody's coming back from the silence. Somebody who, someone you haven't talked to, you know, is coming in. To looks like they want to balance out the scales and have a new start with the Ace of Pens here. So, yeah, best advice for this situation, please. Best advice from lots of idioms.
Ace of Earth. All right, now you got that twice. All right, a flow of abundance, a promise in business venture, important documents and contracts. So it's, it's a new start, too, with the Ten of Water at the bottom of the deck. It's a rewarding family life, too. Emotions and material needs are met. Transworthy relationships, too. So they're saying trust this relationship. If you ask me, it is saying, you know, give it a chance. If you put time into this, give it a chance. You can have a new start. It, it will be good. All right, so it's up to you. I'm not I'm not digging like that. I'm just telling you what you're looking at, okay? So it looks like this relationship can work if you choose to give it time. I love you guys.